Yeah, I gotta go wait. What? Where are we? We're in some sort of chromy place. Did we forget to do that promotional thing for the FNAF Plushie Movie 3? Act 2? Yup, we probably did. Great. Hmm, and now we're stuck in the chromy place again. So Vanny must have reversed everything. Kinda expected that, honestly, but... Eh, uh, what can you say? What do you mean we're Freddy and... Wait. There's no upstairs to this place. It's blank. Uh, Springtrap, you're saying the wrong lines. What, we're not doing another overdone reshoot of the first episode again? Thought that... I thought that was what this movie was supposed to be. Uh, yeah, at one point. It kinda was, and then it was repurposed in the FNAF plushy show, Regravitated. So, uh, do I have anything to say? Cause I didn't talk in this scene originally. Uh, yeah, I didn't either. <laughs> Memes. And of the dankest sort. Uh, so like, when is this parody thing supposed to be anyway? Um, I don't really know. Anybody have any ideas? Let me just make one thing clear. This promotional thing is supposed to be parodying scenes from the actual movies. Uh, no spoilers whatsoever. Uh, so, I guess the only spoiler is that I'm in this scene. But, I mean, it was kind of expected, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, I figured as much. I want to know how I know this is promotional. Because this wall is not set up right. In the actual movie, which this scene is already filmed, this wall is not diagonal. Who did this? I want to know the scoundrel who set this up. As you can see, uh, we've had our old props detailed a little better this time. Um, done this, uh... Now, I don't know how to describe this, except it's withered. Why would it be withered? I don't know. And then you can see the lovely new Gravity Machine version 1, which, yes, the changes on this, it's still canon, okay? Uh, just because it wasn't as complicated looking as it was in, well, actually, the latest episode, um, in the third movie. Uh, it's still canon. Uh, no changes have been made to it. Just looks like this for the purpose of the movie. Um, so, Freddy, since you're the supposed creator, uh, what are the differences? Mangle, you just said that there were no differences. I mean, canonly, no. But visually, yes. Um, we've blacked out other than, well, the Wii sign is still there. I mean, it's just a prop. And, uh, yeah, this is actually super glued now. Um, the tablet isn't. And there's an old Wi-Fi router back there. But, still does the same thing. Canonly. I mean, I don't know what, I don't know what you expect me to say. Why are you, why are you getting close to my face? Ah! Oh, and don't worry folks, uh, by the way, you see, we are paying our actors, uh, considering Mario, uh, and his girlfriend, wife, not confirmed maybe, uh, Princess Peach, is going to be very rich people today. Or, in an actual scene in the movie. You know, that's not really spoilers, um... But, yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's not spoilers, right? I mean, you never even said who's buying anything. You only know from who. And it's a very large amount of money. But what are you guys doing anyway? It's like, are you trying to be, like, just break the fourth wall? Like, a lot? Is that the whole point of this? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it totally is. We're just, just breaking the fourth wall, everybody. And Golden Freddy isn't here to yell at us. Ain't that good? Ain't that perfect?
You know, I'm still kind of upset that he does that. You know what? I'm venting right now. That that's what the that's what the rest of this is gonna be. Golden Freddy's a big mean jerk. He won't let us break the fourth wall, and now is my chance. Now is my chance to break the fourth wall. I'm not even really Peter. I'm being voiced by a by a person named Dylan McLeod right now, who is literally holding see this this is my hand. Okay, this is me. Uh and this is the the point is that we're promoting a movie that, uh, well, I don't even know if I should say this. Um, well, since I'm also <clears throat> being voiced by Dylan McLeod, it's, it, uh, we kind of already started filming for it. In fact, the first scene in the movie is the last scene in the season four finale. Um, just with, you know, edited, uh, different music and stuff. And also, you get to hear the bit at the end uh, that the music screwed up. Um, but we're taking a break from filming. Um, we fully written it. I fully written it. Yeah, because I'm Dylan McLeod. But I'm being voiced by Dylan McLeod. This is so. I don't even know what to say. But anyway, yeah, to get back what this is this is probably like the worst video that's gonna ever come out on this channel um besides uh episodes 13 and 14 of, of the FNAF pleasure show like the two episodes right before the movie this probably ain't gonna be as bad as those will they uh, you know what, since I actually know what I'm talking about here, uh, i just like to say that it's fully written, but we're not continuing filming uh, until the new year, probably, or like late December, I don't know. And that's it, on to the next segment, maybe? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's me. I'm Shane, the power station guy. Yeah, I didn't have the time to change the set. Uh, we're also, my friend Greg and I, uh, not Yoshi, um, but my friend Greg and I are going to be in this movie, and I really enjoy it. Um, if you if you watch it when it comes out, thank you. Uh, have a good night. Uh, invisible mic drop. Ah! Well, cool. He sounded nervous. So, yeah, that's basically it. Goodbye. And, well, I should say happy travels. Hi. Uh, because reasons and other jokes that I've made before. Um, happy travels.